Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be looking at widgets. It doesn't really matter which iPad you guys have, the widgets are the same thing. So we're just going to edit them. So let's get started. Start off, all we have to do is slide this way and you're going to see your widgets, right? So some people want to keep them always on the side and that's perfectly fine. All we guys have to do, and to edit any widget for that matter, just hold your finger on top of any widget and you're going to see these options. One of the options will say edit home screen. That's what we have to do. And right now we can take out any widget just by pressing right here, for example. I can remove that widget. Okay, I can also add more widgets. For example, up here, you're gonna see the plus sign. So let's just tap on that plus sign. And we're gonna see a bunch of more widgets. So let's say I want to add a clock. I can add this one, that one, or this one. So I can choose which design of the widget. Let's just go for this one for now. Add it on there. And that's how I can add any widget on top of here. Now let's say I want to keep all these widgets always on the side on my home screen. Well, up here you're gonna see this and just tap it like so and just drag any widgets that you want to be on your home screen all the time up there. So I'm just gonna drag this one, this one, this one, and this one. I just want those for now. So Right now, to get out of this, I can just press my home button, for example, and get out of it. And right now, you may notice that my widgets will always be here, so I don't have to slide this way anymore. So let's say I go and look at other screens or whatnot, and I go back. These widgets will always be here. I don't have to scroll again to the side in order to get these, so they always stay here. Again, I can just take that off, just by edit home screen, and turn it off. So I can turn that off so my widgets are not always on my screen. Press my home button. Okay, so if I go to like that, like that, if I go back, they're not there. Only if I do this, will they show up right here. Now there is a secondary way to put this on and off, okay, to have your widgets on your screen on and off. Just in case this is not working for any reason, just go right into your settings. Under your settings, just scroll down until you see home screen and dock. Just tap right there, and right here you're gonna have the very first option. Just turn it on, and that way if I go back, this will always be on there. So if I go like that, like that, it's always gonna be on my home screen. Again, I can just take that off by just pressing here, edit home screen, turn that off, home button. If I do this, it's gonna go off and on. So it depends what you guys would like to do. Those are all the basics when it comes down to your widgets. So again, if you would like to add any widgets, I can just press here, home screen, and I can just press the plus sign and just add a bunch of widgets that I have right here. By the way, to get out of this, you don't always have to press your home button. You can always press done on the top right hand corner, press done, and that's it. So the home button, it's just faster, but there's always the done option on the top right hand corner. So that's it for this video. Once again, it doesn't really matter which iPad you guys have. You could have this iPad, this iPad, any iPad. It's going to work the same under iPad OS 14. So that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.